Okay, what up, y'all? We are back with a brand new banger, and this one is even bigger of a banger because this is the brand new LTX V2 model. Uh, it just came out like today, um, and it's crazy. Uh, I don't usually hype models like that because why would I? But this one, this one is just way better than one 2.2 in pretty much every single aspect. Um, so yeah, I'll go over the workflow. Uh, this is uh, the video I got, so I'll just go over the video first. Okay, quick outfit check. I'm obsessed with this dress. It's so comfy, but still looks put together. Perfect for running errands or grabbing coffee with friends. So right now you're asking yourself like, why, why is there a voice there, right? Yeah, yeah, bro. Same, this model does uh, video with audio, which no other model does um, that well. And this video was generated in like a minute, bro. This one took a minute and 35 seconds, okay? So this is insane. This is a 720p so video, 10 seconds, 24 frames per second. Like, uh, no other model can do this right now in the open source. Uh, no, nobody else can do that. So LTX is really on top. It's the best model for AI influencers. Um, and you can already train Loras on it, which means that this can be but whoever you want. Um, and the movement is good. Uh, there's no word fingers. Uh, the frame rate is good. Like, I, I don't see really um, a problem with it, to be honest. This can do a text to video. It can do image to video with this workflow. Um, it's not fully ready yet. Um, there's a couple of issues that I found, but I'll, I'll fix it and release it in the next video probably. Uh, but the text to video is already so good and with Allura, I'm pretty sure it doesn't matter anymore for image to video. Um, and it might even be able to do images. I didn't try it, but I feel like it should be able to because the videos are just, you know, images stick together when you think about it. But yeah, um, I'll go over, I'll run it once because we can run it while uh, we're talking because it's that fast. I'll run it once and I will also, um, I'll, I'll go over the workflow just to explain kind of how it works and that's gonna be the vid. And in the next videos, I'm gonna be, you know, going over all the other features that are included with this uh, brand new model. So let's get it. So I just started it um, here. We load the model. This is a checkpoint. So it contains the VAE and the model directly in there. Uh, we just load, load it here. Uh, for the text encoder, it's Gemma free. Uh, this is the full version. I recommend that you use probably FP8. Um, the full version is 22 gigs, which is almost bigger than the actual checkpoint, which is insane. Um, here uh, we are uh, generating at 720p then uh, so the way it works is um, is going to generate the first video at half the resolution so that's why it's so fast and then it's going to upscale it with uh, the upscale model um, two times so we get back the 720p but it took maybe half or maybe a third of the time um, this is a 24 FPS model, which means that it's better uh, than one in that regard. Um, and they say it can do up to 20 seconds at a time. I didn't try it, but we will definitely be trying that. Uh, so this video is 10 seconds, 240 frames. Then we go here for the prompt. Uh, the way I did it personally is I sent an image to Quen Max. Um, asked it uh, make a prompt for this image uh, for a 10 second video and this is what it gave me um, so you kind of have a choice here you can try and write your prompts yourself but unless you're fucking Shakespeare like you're wasting your time um, here we use a distilled LoRa so it's a 8 step LoRa instead of the full 20 which makes it even faster without even like, I don't even think the quality degradation is that bad when using the distilled version. So I would probably recommend that you use it if you want to have the fastest generations possible. Uh, so eight steps, CFG one, uh, when it's done, we push it to the upscaling. 
uh, it just does its thing. Uh, I'm not gonna go into the Sigmas and all that shit, but it just works. And then we have a fully uh, generated video in how many seconds here? In 98 seconds, we got a 1080p 10 second video with audio and the results are super good. So at home. let's just see here. Okay, quick outfit check. I'm loving simple white top. It's so comfy, but still looks put together. Perfect for running errands or just chilling at home. Like this is insane, by the way, because we can already train Laura's for this. So this he person does. could be uh, whoever you want and uh, you could get a video in about two minutes. So obviously I'll go over the training process for this model. Um, I'll do so many videos on this. I will milk the shit out of this model. Pause, but I will. Um, yeah, that's pretty much it. I'm gonna stop here today. Uh, just wanted to kind of show you guys that it exists. Uh, my my version of the workflow is gonna be available on the WAP for the subs. If you want uh, just the base version, I'll put it uh, with all the links, uh, but it's just gonna be the base version that you can get here. And yeah, uh, make sure you update your config UI to make this work. And I will be seeing you in the next video, uh, probably about image to video. And yeah, let's get it guys. We are liking that shit. Let's go.